Hi everyone. So in this video, we will learn how to use feather icons in your web project. As you can see, currently I am on feathericons.com. These icons are completely SVG based icons. They are not font based icons. So if you want to download them, you can download them by clicking on any icon of your choice. And you can even adjust the size, stroke width and color. Uh, let's make it red here. Let's increase the size. And let's increase the stroke width like this. Now let's say I want to download this one, color triangle. I can simply click on this. And you can see it got downloaded. If you want to download the entire package, you can simply click on this download all button but i want to go with a different approach i don't want to download an individual file or entire package and use in my project instead of that i would like to go with some cdn link to get the cdn link you have to click on this link github here and you will get this page just scroll a bit and they have given a very basic example here i think so to use this in your project you simply need three things first the script tag, second, this i element, and third, the script tag at the bottom with this uh, feather dot replace method. Let's go to code editor. Create index file here, index.html. Let's have a basic HTML structure. Now go to the web page. Just copy this, paste it here. Also copy this here, create a div element, use a style attribute, text align should be center, just to center line the icon and paste what we just copied. Also we need this script tag, simply copy it and paste it here like this. Now let's open this file in the browser to see the output and that's the output. Let's try a different icon. Reload this. Let's go with some box icon. So to use an icon, you simply need to use these names, what they have given just below the icon. So I'll go with this box. Save it. Let's go to browser to see if it is working or not. So it's working. Now let's try to increase the size and change the color for that on this page you need to scroll a bit and you will find some attributes these are the attributes so let's just copy this and paste it here let's make it 50 same goes here let's change the stroke simply copy this paste it here Let's make it red. Also, we need a fill. So, we'll make the fill blue. Now, just save it. Go to the browser. And that's the output. In a similar way, you can try other icons. Let's try a few more. Let's pick bell icon. Okay. Just copy and paste it. Let's make it bell. Also, let's have one circle too. Save it. Let's go to the browser. And that's the output. Now, one thing you may have noticed that we are repeating the attributes again and again and again for every icon. So for that, there's a solution. If you want to apply same style to all the icons, you can simply pass an object here and use these attributes as key value pair. So let's make the width 50, height 50, stroke green, and let's make the fill red. I just remove these attributes. Now we don't need them. So we just save this file and go to the browser and that's the output. In this video, I've just covered the basic stuff about the feather icons, but I recommend you to have a look over this GitHub page to learn more about it. So that's enough for this video. 
See you in the next tutorial. Have a nice day.